North Carolina has swept Duke. Can Michigan State do the same to Michigan? An early 5-0 lead for the Wolverines with a share of the Big Ten title on the line tonight in East Lansing. Downstairs, the first two for Tillman for Michigan State. Maybe the biggest game in Breslin Center history. Michigan, Michigan State, top 10 teams playing for a title. McQuaid got bumped, got killed. Follow, good. I don't know how you miss that. Try to watch the defender on the ball screener. That time was a switch. There's going to be a lot of things happening on ball screens. Sampson blocked by Tillman. Winston ridden by Poole. Winston! No time for a screen off the steal from Tillman and a foul against Bryce Dakins. Hey, let's be honest. Tillman gives them a great element. Long, athletic, tough around the basket. The kid has lost about 25 pounds, maybe more, since he's been here and has developed into a heck of a player. In high school. You said it. Where will the points come from for Michigan well, State? They just brought in Winston, and there it is right there. It was either going to be Goins, Winston, or McQuaid. There's your switch. Simpson. That's exactly what John Beeline said N didn't need to happen. That happened in game one. Nobody found it. And then suddenly give up a dunk. In half number one. How about Kithy made the switch to pull, stayed in front. Made him shoot a fadeaway. All right, swashbuckling for two. Oh, he's hurt. He's grimacing on his way down the court. Boy, is he a tough kid. Look at him. He just pushed that crowd, Arms did, from 8 to 11. Henry the drop off and the slam for Tillman. <laughs> DeJulius blocked by Tillman. Michigan leads by six at the half. Some foul trouble for Cassius Winston. Two personals, one for five from the floor. And he added, you know, our three stars, our three best players, are having one of their worst games of the season. He was referencing Cassius Winston, Matt McQuaid, and Kenny Goyan saying, I think this is the worst I've ever seen Cassius Winston play. And he finished with, our best players got to play well for us to win, and trust me, I let them know that. Now we're ready for the second half of our Sonic Blockbuster, and we'll see what changes Michigan State makes. Kenny Goins behind the screen, knocks it down, Tillman got him free. That's why you move the ball side to side. You gotta go to work here, you gotta just go right over him. Winston. That, look at that. Oh, McQuaid finds two and a foul. Big time recruit, Michigan beat Illinois out, and he's going to be terrific. You can imagine he'll be much bigger next time we see him as Winston takes him to the bucket. That was so good. They got Winston off the ball and gave him a running start. So what does Michigan State need to do defensively? Stay on the line of the ball. Don't you jump to the ball, not jump backwards. Nobody wants to shoot. McQuaid does, and got it. Oh, I like it. Tillman wrap around, arms the cut. Great back cut. Oh, a little 
shake and bake. That was nasty. That was, that was nice. Uh-oh. Goins wide open. Breslin has erupted. Thorne's <laughs> got into pool. Winston scanning. An entire state on the line. And a whistle as Tillman got to the rim. Waffle guy? Yeah, we were watching him out there. He looks, he looks like he had a long spring break, long drive to get here. A lot of syrup. He's trying to rile him up. We're tied at 50. Teske way short. That's an air ball waffle. Michigan State can take the lead. Maybe get a little more pleasant of a look on Waffle Guy. Winston. Oh! Take it in, Waffle Guy. Watch the slip screen here by Big. Let's see. What are you looking at? Well, it was a staple of, of Michigan State to go slip the screen. Nice. Instead, turn to Winston. Henry squeals the brakes and scores. There's your right hand, but he made it from the middle of the court, not trying from the side. He's got a ball screen again. There you go. And let him go. Turn the corner, make a play. He beats Teske and scores. Four ball screen. It's a seismic night in East Lansing. <laughs> those old rivalries, though, sometimes you lose a game. They started playing in 1909. Michigan State has taken control. The winner shares the Big Ten title with oh, Purdue. Man. Oh, the stuff for Tillman off the hand of Winston. This is the best environment of the year. Oh, yeah. This is incredible here. Purdue was great last week against Ohio State, but this is incredible. It's nonstop. Oh. Winston takes Simpson and scores. For five, McQuay. And a hold on the rebound against the Wolverines. It's on Brostakis. He will be leaving to a serenade at the Breslin Center. Dan said, good call. Normally, you'll tell the audience first, but Dan takes it for himself. I told Terry Oglesby, he was looking over at me, the referee. Collectively. Watch this. He's going to go, I think. There he goes. Come on, Tillman. No reset of the shot clock. Yeah, but man. Oh, why'd you jump? 
That did hit the rim. What about Tillman? Tillman has played a, look at this. I mean, he has played a great second half on the defensive end. Now he's got his hands on the ball. He's gone straight up, protected the rim. He's hedged the ball screens. He's switched on the people. Playing his large role with Nick Ward injured with the hand problem. Winston. Goins got a hand in there. And Michigan State resets. Goins hasn't been bad either. Winston dancing for two more. MVP of the Big Ten. Player of the year in the Big Ten. First team All-American, Cassius Winston. Got it close at the end, and Winston made all the free throws down the stretch. Well, he gets hit more with the ball than any kid in college basketball without a call. How many times are you going to get hit here? He should get a free game in pinball for this. Jeez, it happened the other night, too. Dunk. McQuaid, happy senior night. out of bounds by Tillman. And I want to flesh that out more. What do you mean in terms of body language for Cassius well, Winston? Well, he moves like a guy that's ready to do the next play. Like, even when he stands, it's like he's a shortstop, not just a guy. You know? he, he looks ready all the time to do something else. And not a lot of guys do that. Like win a Big Ten title? Oh, right here. These two should play the last day of the regular season every year. Totally agree. I think Indiana and Purdue should play the last game of the regular season. I think Michigan, Michigan State should play the last game of the regular season. It's the first time they've played where both could have won a Big Ten title. Everything on the line here. And for college kids, let's be honest, you want to come in here 10 years from now and see a banner that you contributed to, a ring that you have that your kids get to see, your grandkids. That's what this game was about in Michigan State second half, as good as they have played in a long time. Time to hang a new banner. Here's a timeout. Off the whistle. They'll turn it over. Tom Izzo will substitute for his seniors. Goins and McQuaid coming out for the final time at the Breslin Center. A former walk-on turned into as valuable a guy as Michigan State has, not named Cassius Winston. Nearly lost his mom over a decade ago. He's turned into a major role player and starter for the Big Ten champions with Purdue. Michigan State shares the Big Ten title with a win over Michigan.
Your second straight Big Ten regular season title, your ninth overall. How much sweeter is this because it came against your biggest rival? Well, this is the thing I told my team. You know, I played for a championship on the last game. I played my rival in the last game. Never played for a championship on senior night with a rival. And Michigan's a hell of a team. They did a heck of a job the first half, kicked our butt. Give our kids some credit. Second half, we really played. Coach, you look emotional. Why are you crying? Hey, hell of a year. We had a hell of a year. Proud of my guys. Happy for you guys. Happy for Cassius. Just a good day. You told your seniors before the game you wouldn't appreciate them till after the game. What did you say to Kenny Goins and Matt McQuaid? I love you both, man. And they said the same thing. There's something about this that is special. And these guys did a hell of a job this year. They had more adversity than Carter got liver pills. And we did a hell of a job. Congrats on the win, Coach. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Jason. Molly, thank you. Dan, it's been a great season. Awesome. Thanks to our entire crew. He's Dan. I'm Jason. She's Molly. Dave Pass out west. Good luck with Uncle Bill.